Welcome to how to build an original seafront bungalow, part 141. Today is a glorious day in Jaywick, and we have a special guest today who's working with us. His name is Dylan. Hello, Dylan. How are you today? Hello, boy. Dylan's like our mascot, and we're going to hold him up in the air because he can wave his hands like he just don't care. And today we are going to remove all of the stuff that we do not need. So, all of this plasterboard, that, like all this plasterboard can go. All this plasterboard can go because this is old. And it's about time it was brought forward to the year 2019. So, without further ado, this is how to untangle your French Bulldog from a long lead. There you go. I don't think that's going to be the first time that I untangle him today. Once we get rid of all the debris plasterboards, we then need to like untangle all these wires. We need to put sockets in every room with new cable. So when the plaster has come in about three or four days, all the wires are in place and all they've got to do is give us a face, a plaster face. So none more of your poker face. We're talking about your plaster face. Today we are removing all of this. And it's that simple to do. Plasterboard away. This is how to repair, this is how to regenerate a bus, an original Jaywick Seafront bungalow. Today is all about plasterboard. Whatever you're doing, make sure it's great. And remember, to shine on because this is how to regenerate this is how to rebuild an original seafront bungalow part 141 shine on it's my fault dylan dylan it's my fault dylan 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 Hey, hello boy. Dylan, here. Come on, 